Hi. In last video, we have seen how we can export the data in different different file format, such as Excel format, CSV format, and PDF format. In this video, we are going to see how we can import the data to the Django project, or in simple word, you can say how we can upload the different different file format to the Django project and how we can use that data. So before going to start that things first let me show you my admin page for that go to the admin page slash admin yeah this is my model name which is records after clicking record here and if you remember these are the record what we have added through the front end but in this case i am going to add the records from the csv file and simply you can see I will maintain all the data in this CSV file and in one shot I will upload that data to the Django project to this to this Django CRM project so let's start let me show you how we can achieve that things for that go to the command prompt and here we are going to perform the import of import operation for that we need some libraries let me install that library that pip install django pip install then django django dash import dash export enter this the Django import export library we require to upload the CSV file. Once again, it's downloading all the required packages. Yeah, downloaded successfully. Then let me run the Django server again. For that, we have a command python manage.py run server enter. Then after that, we need to add this Django import export library inside the our settings.py file. For that, go to the settings.py file inside the Visual Studio code, then settings.py file. Inside the install app, we need to register here, single code. Export. Then next step two, we have to register this import and export this import export inside the admins.py file. For that, go to the admins.py file. Then here we need to import one library which is import export model admin. For that, we need to import the import export model admin. For that, from import underscore export export dot admin dot admin then import import then import export model admin model admin that's it then control s let me check one second import export dot admin import import export model admin then simply copy this one and paste here we don't require this one so paste here then control s then go to the command prompt one second let me run the django server again Now oh, here we are getting one error one second let me check we have did one spelling mistake here in one second control s then go to the browser and here also we need to change control s run the django server again yeah it's working fine so go to the browser browser and then refresh this one but before going to import let me show you the home page 
my CRM. Here you can see the, these are the data we have already and now I'm going to add some additional data here with the help of the file which is any format like Excel, CSV or any format for that you can add the data. So go to the admin page admin page then click on your model see basically this model is nothing your table only so this is the table where you want to add the record through the file so click on import see your option is showing import export so to add the file or to upload the file to the your table click on import then from here you can choose the file and from here you can select the format of the file and see these are the fields name what your file should be contained so let me show you the file what i have created already one second yeah see this is the file what i have created and i am going to upload this file one very important thing whatever field name it's showing here the exactly same field name you need to mention here otherwise your data will not upload properly so make sure this field should be saved whatever written here then next step choose the file so over the desktop one file is crm then click on open the file format is csv then here also it should be csv only then click on submit after clicking on submit here you can see the preview of the data what it's going to be uploaded and here also it's showing one message like if you are satisfied with the result click on confirm import so these are the data what i'm going to be upload in this particular table which is records or in django it's called model then click on confirm report yeah so here you can see upender divakar vinod durgesh this all data is showing let me show you the my file see durgesh vinod divakar upender these are i have added and one more thing this id and created at i have kept the auto increment so because of that only it's not required to pass here it will automatically capture then go to the browser and one more thing i want to show you go to the import and here you can see different different file format is there it means you can upload the data through the different different file format like csv xls xlxl tsv json yml this thing this type of file you can upload then go to the records then here you can see one export option is also showing so this is the format from here you can select the different different format and export the data from this records table or model so for example let me show you how we can export from here also for example you want to export in the json format or let it be in csv format then simply click on submit see click on open yeah all the data whatever that table have it's successfully exported so these are the way how we can export let me show you for the json also click on submit then open see here you got json format if you know what is the json then you can see understand data. json is nothing but the simply key and value pair type of data see this is the key and this is the value like that so thank you so much for watching this video and please like and subscribe bye